Woodbury County's new jail project. Today, the authority that oversees that project released in its agenda packet a new proposed opening date. That date proposed by the project's general contractor, Houseman Construction. KTIV's Matt Hoffman joins us live in studio now with the very latest development coming from the company that is tasked with getting that building finished. And Matt, why is this new information so important? Yeah, sure, Larry. We've been waiting to see if the authority could meet its second substantial completion deadline set for about a month from today. And if the contractor gets its way, the project will have missed the deadline for a second time. Now, you're looking at what the authority calls a prime contract change order. The request was created one week ago, March 1st. In the PCCO, Housing Construction proposes a new opening date of May 23rd. That's more than one month after the currently scheduled date. And the contractor says they're reserving their right to get, quote, concurrent costs. Now, according to Housing Construction, if the request was approved, it would raise the total project cost by just over $8,300. Remember, the jail was scheduled to open last September, but it was delayed primarily because of fire damper issues. The authority then set the new opening date of April 9th, so the contractor is now requesting to take longer. It's also worth noting that the contractor requests for more time doesn't include what they called, quote, unapproved requests. Today's agenda packet was released after the authority announced on Thursday that some of the project site actually flooded earlier this week. Now, the authority's chairman responded to KTIV in an email just before our show, and we have his full response on our website right now, ktiv.com.